The Mud Hens opening day is Tuesday, April 5th, and as you can see, preparations are underway for making their 20th season one that's going to be out of this park. It's, it's hard to believe it's coming quick, but after a, a long, cold winter, what better rite of passage in spring than Mud Hens opening day? Absolutely. Week. Yeah, and they're going to be taking on the Rochester Red Wings. Yes. What do you think about that matchup? Do we have a good chance? Uh, of we should. Them? We yeah. should. I think the team's going to be pretty good. The final roster is just about set, so uh -huh. we, we don't know exactly who's going to be here yet, but based upon last year's team, and how well the Tigers are doing and the, the kids that they have coming up through their system. Right. We should be really good all year long. The game starts at four, which means there's a lot of opening day activities prior to it. So when does everything kick off and what can we expect? Well, I think downtown usually gets busy around noon. Yep. Bars and restaurants are packed. People take the day off of work and things will get kicking out at the ballpark around 2.30 2 when the gates open. Okay. Uh, a lot of live music, some DJs in various places, okay. lots of opportunities to hang out before the pregame really gets started about 3.45. That's one of the best things about minor league baseball, just the camaraderie, the people that want to follow the game closely can, right. and the people that just want to hang out and socialize, that, that's there for them too. Every year in fan wear and the merchandise, we have new hats, a collection of things specific. We're getting new stuff in every day. Yeah. So it's always fun for people their first time or two down to the fifth or field each year to check out the Swamp Shop and, and see what we have for the upcoming season. Yeah, get a fresh new shirt or cap for the fresh new season. Now, are there things that you guys are going to be able to do this season that you weren't able to last season? I think some of the restrictions, some of the promotions and things that we'll be able to bring back. Uh, you know, our promotional schedule. If you go to mudhens.com, there's a ton of fun things to do there. Yeah. The big thing is just no capacity restrictions, and that's what we started with last year. And so this will really be the first true opening day that everybody has come to expect and love since 2019. Are we expecting a sold out game? Yes, yes. Yeah. We still have tickets available. You okay. can go to mudhens.com yep. to see what's there. But we will get to a sellout before the end of the day on Tuesday. We might have 12, 13,000 at the ballpark, but there's an estimated 25 or 30,000 people that come downtown yeah. on opening day to just be a part of the festivities. We, and we're praying for great weather. Yeah. Weather like this, right? The sunny, it's always weather. sunny and dry at the third field. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Emily and this is Toledo Now.